Hi there, this is David, and welcome back to Let's Play Popo LaCroix. Today I have Gabo, of all people, in my party, because we are going to finally get his summons. Yeah, so that'll be pretty nice. He might actually come in useful for a change. I mean, I don't think that he will, but, you know, maybe. There's always a chance. But uh, I do want to talk to Elena while I'm here in Popo LaCroix. Oh, I made a charm for you. Awesome. Great. And we get Elena's charm. Let's, uh, look, look at that. I don't think it's all that great, but hey, it's something that you could equip if you want to. It raises his magic defense and his luck by a lot. So that's okay. It's nothing great, but eh, it's there. I figured I'd show it off. So let's go ahead and get his first charm. And the way that this, or summon, the way that this is going to work is um, because each summon deals with a boss battle, I am not going to show the boss battle during the regular episode. I'm going to cut it and put it at the end of the episode, so there's going to be a ton of boss battles, so um, this might be a pretty long episode if you choose to watch the uh, battles that are associated with it. Uh, basically, what you're looking for is strange objects that are glowing like this, and they only glow whenever Gabo's in your party. Oh, and by the way, as far as my strategy against all these bosses, it's pretty much the same. Uh, we're going to be um, focusing and then using Thunderstrike with Pietro, with Jilva, she's going to be healing with Heal Dance or using Axel Spin. Kim Dondoji is going to be focusing and then using Death Blow. And Gabo is probably going to die. If he's not dead, he's going to summon orbs. And the orbs that I'm going to summon are the Dyson Orb and the Zappa Orb. And if Gabo's dead, I'll have Jilva do it. It really doesn't matter. But that's pretty much the strategy. Each dragon has a, or summon has about 10,000 HP. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Gabo. Yeah, he's uh, sensing something there. Oh, how strange. The time has finally come. The time to seal Barbara in. Are you? No, you can't be. Me? Oh, what power, young Dragon King. That bright light is wonderful. And... I can feel it. Even as a small dragon, that light is eternally strong. Ha! Huh. It's always fascinating how fate works. I must test you and see if you're worthy. Okay, took care of him. Well done, you've won. This eternal light comes now. Very interesting. I'm Esperanza. Call me when you need me. You won't be disappointed. And he, whenever you summon him, he just does a regular, like a physical based attack. So he's pretty good, actually. All the summons are pretty good, but now the painting's gone. Let's talk to this guy. Yeah, the drawing disappeared and Esperance became real. That's impossible. Drawings can't become real. He must have been dreaming. Huh. And you can talk to this guy over here, and he tells you where other summons can be found. What's this a dolphin in a book? I can see something that looks like ruins. The place is high up. There's a drawing of a bird on the ground, a flying rock. I can see a large stained glass. It must be a big building. A dense and lush forest. There's a huge owl. Okay, and he gives us some directions, like through the lost woods. A lonely place. I've never seen any place like this. There are many objects there. Yeah, so um, that's all he says. Those are the location of the summons. There are six summons total, so uh, I'm going to heal up and then meet you in Tekinanen Village for the next summon. I'm in the village, and also in the interest of time, I think whenever I splice this video together and I put um, all the battles together, what I'm going to probably do is fast forward the battles, probably not to such a high speed, but to a decent speed so you don't have to waste too much time watching the battles if you don't want to. Yeah, something else is there. A high place, a floating rock. Hmm, how did a baby dragon break through my seal? Huh, alright. Can you really defeat me? Do you have the power? Bring it on! Okay, took care of him. Ooh, nice experience there. Gabu still died, because he sucks. Hmm. I can't
can't believe I lost to a baby dragon. I'm Kara. In compliance with the ancient rule, I'll obey your order. Call upon you whenever you need my assistance. See you soon. Awesome! And we get Kara summon, who does a wind attack to everybody. So, Gabo's moving up in the world. Not that I'll really use him, but hey, it's there. So, I'm going to again heal up, then I'm going to meet you in Pesela, but it's not just Pesela. You're going to want to go to the port and buy a ticket to go to Brionia, and then I'll meet you whenever I'm in Brionia. Okay, I went to Pesela, I took the ship, docked here in Brionia, so what we want to do is head to the library. If you remember the satyr, or the seer, or whatever his name was, he said that he saw dolphins, which is a reference to the dolphin show here, ruins, and he said he saw a book. So we want to head over to the library, and there it is. There's that glowing book. Let's check it out. Whoa. It's the page master? What's going on? It's a frog with fish eyes looking all over the place. How strange. Gobi? Um, okay. <laughs> oh, did you wake me up? Oh, you are. I understand. You need my power. I know, I know, I know. You don't have to tell me. Of course I'll help you, but this is my fate too. Let me test you. Yeah, it's time to fight! Bring it on! Yeah! Let's do this! Okay. And Gabo again died. You would think that with all this experience that he'd be getting, he'd finally be able to survive one of these battles. Man, I lost. I give up. You're pretty good. My name is Burren Bobbin. Call me whenever you need my help. I'll do my best. Awesome. So, he, as you would probably assume, deals a water attack to all enemies. And all the summons, I'll show you after this, they all cost a lot of MP. And Gabo is a decent amount, but he can really use, like, two summons, and that's pretty much it until he's out of MP. Yeah, he is, you know, 180 uh, MP, but look how much these these summons cost. They're pretty ridiculous. So, anyway, as usual, I'm going to go save, heal up, and meet you back in Roma Kingdom. I'm all ready to go, and to get at this next summon, you just want to head inside the castle as if you're headed towards the throne room, and it's right here. Okay, it looks like a unicorn of some sort, a big mosaic. I mean, the guy did say something about a stained glass window and a big building, and Roman Castle really is huge. It's a pretty gaunt-looking unicorn, I've got to say. Monoceros! Huh? My name is Monoceros. Well, let's go! Well, Gabo actually survived. Who knew? You are strong. When you need me, call me. I'll come. It's not like he survived because, you know, he's stronger or anything. He survived because... He didn't really attack. He used a physical hit for about 40. He didn't even attack Gabba with it. And his mass, like, main thing was a self-healing move for 750, so that was pretty crappy. Anyway, I'm going to heal up and meet you at North Mountain. Okay, here I am. It's right by uh, Leona's house. And I want to head in here and talk to Leona's father. Yeah. What's it going to give us? A Robin Orb, which is another summoning thing that I'm never going to use. So make sure you have Guardian cast so that nothing bothers you, and then head on into the forest. So it gave you some directions before, and it said up, left, or up, 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 but that is confusing to me. You want to head right, then you want to head up, then you want to head right, right, and right again. And this is where we got our treasures last time. And now we can actually, you know, identify this thing for our next summon. Oh, and by the way, that unicorn summon, it heals everybody and it removes all status ailments and things like that.
Oh, cool. It's like a flying wolf. Who are you guys? What do you want from me? We want Gabo! Oh, I see. That's why the seal was broken. I never thought that it would be you. You want my power, right? All right. Yeah, why else am I bothering you? I'm not coming here to have tea with you or anything. Yeah, of course, you need to test you. Well, not bad at all, except that Gabo died on the very first hit, and he just used physical attacks, too. You'd think he'd have a chance to survive. Huh, well done. Huh, I guess I lost. All right, I'm Marquios. I'll give you my power. Call me when you need my power. And he does a regular attack, much like uh, the first guy that we got, Esperanz. So, there we go. Done with that. So, I'm going to escape this place, heal up, and then definitely save. Because we're headed off to Remoria Continent. Okay, so the very last option on our list is Remoria Continent, so let's head there. Are you ready to go? Yeah, let's go. And make sure that you have saved. I know I said it before, but make sure because I'm going to be going back to a previous save file. I am not bringing Gabo to Remoria Continent. It's not going to happen. So, yeah, I'm sure. Let's go. Let's do this. Oh, my guardian's still active. Perfect. I want a healing point too. Nice. So it's pretty close by um, the summon in here. It's uh, just right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bark at it. We know. This is our final summon too. Thank God. Who is it that disturbs my sleep? It's you. Sorry, I just can't understand what you're saying at all. I wonder if uh, Leona was here, if she would be able to translate. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Sorry. I still don't know what you're saying, but... You're bleeding because you broke the seal. That means that you need my power. But, can you handle my power? Whew. Well, that was harder, I've got to say, but still pretty simple. Yeah, I guess I lost. Huh? Why are you mad at me? Are you saying I didn't try my hardest? Who do you think you are? Well, it was kind of tiring holding a sword by my pinky. <laughs> Don't get mad. You're strong. Call me when you need my power. By the way, my name is King Knight. Till next time. Okay, very cool. So we got all the summons. Lovely. <laughs> uh, let's see. You know what we could do? We could just go ahead and uh, show off some of the summons real quick. With if Gabba survives. Uh, let's see. He actually has enough HP, or MP, to show him off. Let's try the King Knight. Why not? It seems to be, uh, cool. And to think that I was about to, to end the episode. Look at that damage. Yeah, I'll go ahead and show off the other summons, and then, uh, I'll just show off the other summons, and then next time on Let's Play Pope Lacroix, we will finish exploring Remoria Continent and head into Myra's Temple herself. Be sure to stick around to see the summons, and also to, um, to see the boss fights if you're into that. This has been David. If you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe, and happy watching!